Hi everyone, welcome back to Clean Eating Kitchen. This is my channel where I share easy, gluten-free and dairy-free recipes and tips. So today we're doing a Trader Joe's haul after vacation. So I'm going to show you most of the basics that I stocked up on. I didn't get a lot of the extra packaged foods and things like that. I just got the bare basics for the next few days because I cleaned out my refrigerator before we left for Hawaii. And now that we're home, we really have nothing left. I would say near nothing left in the refrigerator. So I just needed some basics, mostly produce and things like that. So I'm going to show you. I have a few little treats for the next few days, and I'll show you those too. So I hope this gives you some great inspiration for your next Trader Joe's trip. Let's start over here with our fresh produce, mostly fruits and things. I got some lemons, I got some limes, I was really, and some oranges, and these are all organic, which is really nice. And the citrus, I was really inspired from our trip to Hawaii. We had a lot of citrus flavored foods, and so I'm planning to make some citrus uh, fish later this week, and I will try to show you that recipe. I also got some organic beets and some organic apples. And I plan to make some fresh vegetable juice uh, probably tomorrow just to get some extra nutrients. I'm sure um, that you have a similar experience when you go on vacation, you don't maybe don't get as much, um, I guess, nutrition and vegetables as when you're home. And so I like to do a green juice uh, with apple, cucumber, beets, carrots, and celery. And I actually have some celery left in the fridge. That was the one produce item that I had left. But let's continue on here. I did get some potatoes. I'm going to make some mashed potatoes tonight with dinner. And let's see, I got some tomatoes, some little cherry tomatoes. These are organic. And I'm going to be making a salad. And these are great on the salad. I did get some Oops, some salad mix here, which I'm going to make for lunch today. Actually, I'm going to make have a little special treat. I'll show you in a second what I'm going to make for lunch. Then I got some fresh herbs, and Trader Joe's is so great about having organic herbs. Herbs. So I got these chives, which I'm going to use with the fish I make later this week. Um, some basil. I'm going to make a pesto to go with that fish. And I got some mint, and I love to put mint in my smoothies. Um, let's see what else. Oh, I got these microgreens. This is something new I've been putting in my smoothies. It's actually not that hard to grow your own sprouts and microgreens, but often I am too lazy to do that. Um, but maybe I can do a video about that sometime. Let me know if you're interested. I got some carrot juice, organic carrot juice, which I mentioned in my Costco haul and a few other videos that I use as the base of my green smoothies and it makes them a little bit sweeter and gives you of course extra nutrition and then this is my favorite green to put in smoothies these days it's the baby kale just because it's so tender and I actually do steam all my greens before I put them in my green smoothies it helps reduce the oxalates and it makes them easier to digest and my husband has a a kidney stone and that's the concern about eating a lot of raw greens um actually they can also impact your thyroid but for us and for him specifically um we have to just be a little careful about oxalates and actually beets are really high in oxalates so um but he doesn't really drink the green juice that's mostly for me i did get some bananas i got a mix of organic and non-organic because i wanted one for today and then these will be for later in the week I really like these shallots from Trader Joe's. They're just loose, so you have to, I just put them in a bag like this. Um, I got some mushrooms, which I'll, I'm not sure what I'm going to use these for, but I love these shiitake mushrooms. I'm not really a big mushroom person. I don't like the big, like, button mushrooms or the portobellos, but I really like the shiitakes. And then for protein, I got some chicken breast and some ground turkey. And that'll just be for lunches and things like that. And then for easy lunch, mostly for my husband, I got some sliced ham and turkey. And one thing about having migraines is I have to be cautious about 
um, using like preserved meats like bacon and these, even though these are nitrate free, um, I still have to be careful. It's better if you have migraines to have fresh cooked proteins as opposed to the smoked or cured or canned. Um, so just something to be aware of. Here's the cilantro that got put over here, but um, I'll use that somehow this week. And then for our little treats here, we did get some more of our favorite chocolate. It's organic, it's 73% cacao, so it's very dark. And it's just a really great price, it tastes great. We took a bunch of these bars, maybe two bars, two, two or three bars, to Hawaii, and we ate almost all of it, and it really kept us away from the decadent desserts that, um, we just kind of wanted to stay away from when we were on vacation because then we start to feel kind of sluggish. But the chocolate is such a great way to satisfy your sweet tooth and it's healthy too. And then this is a little treat. I buy a lot of these and they're not dairy free, just to be clear. They do have some mozzarella, but they're gluten free. And then I love that it's uncured pepperoni and this doesn't seem to bother um, or trigger migraine for me. And it's just enough cheese. It doesn't really seem to bother me or my husband because we both try to stick to dairy-free and it's on a cauliflower crust. I think it also has some cassava and I highly recommend these. Anyway, so this is my Trader Joe's haul. I think it ended up being about $125, $130 or so and this will for sure last us about five or six days. Um, and then I'll, of course, need to go shopping again. So that's it. Thank you so much for watching. And please do check out my similar gluten-free and dairy-free Costco haul, which I will link right here.